Vending machines are the latest addition to Fortnite Battle Royale, introducing a new way for players to obtain rare weapons and equipment during each match. Vending machines are scattered throughout the map in Battle Royale, and require materials to make a transaction. So these vending machines are pretty straightforward. If you have gathered plenty of building materials and have some to spare, you can spend materials at the vending machines to obtain new weapons and consumables. Each vending machine will offer three different item deals, and will randomly determine the rarity for those items. All three items for sale in a single vending machine will have the same rarity. According to Epic, the breakdown for the costs are 100 materials for common items, 200 materials for uncommon, 300 for rare, 400 for epic, and 500 materials for legendary items. You can also hit the vending machine with your pickaxe to cycle through the items. Otherwise, the three sale items will cycle on their own. There's no limit to how many items you can buy from the vending machine, so long as you've got materials to spend. Unlike some of the weekly challenges in Fortnite, vending machines do not necessarily spawn at a location every time, but they do tend to spawn in predictable locations similar to chests. So when visiting one of the vending machine locations on the map, keep in mind that you may not find a vending machine there every time. But the chances are better than just wandering around aimlessly looking for vending machines on your own. So keep an eye out for vending machines in cities like Tilted Towers, Pleasant Park, and Retail Row. Some vending machines can also spawn along paths leading from towns or major points of interest. The map that we have on screen does not show every vending machine location, but just the general locations we know so far. So use this as a guideline and start looking. That's it for the video. If you enjoyed what you saw, be sure to like and subscribe. Check back every weekday for another Prima 365, and for more content like this, be sure to head over to primagames.com.